Okay guys, for part two of this series, I'm going to show you how to integrate Notion MCP with Claude Code. MCPs allow you to essentially connect Claude Code to other applications across the internet. So what I've done is basically I've created this doc that walks you through how to set up Notion MCP because it's really easy. Uh, we're just going to have to run a simple command, but before that, we have to get our keys. So open up your browser. You're going to go to notion.so slash my integrations. You're going to create a new integration. You're going to call it Claude MCP demo. And you're going to pick your workspace, internal, add a logo if you want, save that, and then configure the settings. So from here, you're going to be in this configuration tab. This should be set already how you need it, unless you want to change what user information that Claude code will get, or if you want to give Claude the ability to read and write comments. Otherwise, you just have to go over to this access tab and you're going to select pages. Now, if you understand how Notion works, it's hierarchical. So if you select a team space at the top level, it's going to give you access to everything under it. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to update the access. Go to configuration and I am going to copy this key. And now that I have my key, I'm going to, for the sake of this, just copy this whole command with my key in it. And voila, MCP server should have been added. So if I hit Claude, now we're not going to do it right here. We're going to just go into the lab and I'm going to hit Claude and I'm going to be like, hey, Claude. What MCP servers do you have? Is Notion available? If so, tell me some of what you see in our database. Sweet. So Claude clearly knows exactly what tool it'll run and it's got information about how to use Notion MCP. And you said, I could see you have both Notion and Google Calendar MCP, which I set up myself. Very useful, guys. Look, it's got my key databases, blog, projects, meeting notes, book of biz, fundraising, timelines, and <laughs> note, notable pages. Workspace appears well organized for managing business operations, client projects, content creation, and fundraising activities. Your databases are interconnected with relations between projects, people, company, and tasks. Thanks, Claude. How about add a new task for using Notion MCP with Claude code? And let's see, can Claude add a task for us? So Claude is querying a database right now. So we can hit control R if we want to expand this out and see more of what Claude is getting. And somewhere in there was tasks, tasks, there we go. That's our database. So Claude sees that and I'll make it out of this one. And now, so Claude is text, create a, a, an educational video demonstrating how to use Notion MCP server with Claude code, integrating setup, business operations, and practical use. Let's proceed. Sweet. Now let's mark it as done. And while Claude does that, I'm going to open up Notion and let's see tasks, create video using Notion DP with Claude code. Awesome. How about marking that as done? Status done. Bang. Superpower. Uh, Notion MCP. Claude code. MCP should be this easy. It's as simple as that. All right. Thanks, guys. Until next time, uh, we'll get into how to use sub agents and the new agent feature with Claude code. All right. Peace out.